Yeah, smart art of war games here. Let's check out the Operation Art of War Century of Warfare. That was the final release by Talonsoft before the entire franchise was taken over by Matrix Games, which then improved on the latest release by Talonsoft. And yeah, Century of Warfare is including Volume 1 which was focusing on 20th century warfare from the 39 to the mid 50s yeah recently we checked out volume 2 which was focusing on modern warfare with an emphasis on cold war starting afterwards up to the millennium and yeah this release released in 2000 is including volume 1 and volume 2 but furthermore adding world war 1 scenarios and thus you get the entire century of warfare yeah? yeah and while preparing for that stream i found this page here which is preserving the history and a lot of those Community made scenarios for the entire franchise, alternatewars.com. Yeah, we are familiar with this page from our Steel Panther videos. I also worked together with the creator. Yeah, he's also doing a very valuable job in preserving digital war game history and resources uh, like we do here. That is really nice. And yeah. You might also find here some downloads. Good, I have the game ready. Yeah, those Talesoft releases without any modifications. You can install them on uh, Windows 10, 11, but they won't boot up. Yeah, probably you might manage to boot them up with some tools like DXWND. Or voodoo I didn't go those lengths but I have a virtual box ready XP32 and have it booted up yeah, so that is here century of warfare the complete art of war collection up to this point of course later on then matrix when they took over released TOAW3 and the current version 4 so let's check out the scenario list. It is huge. And you already see yeah, Balkans, World War I time frame is included. Up to 2000. A lot of the scenarios you might also find in TOIW4. Um, can't confirm that all of them are included there, but yeah. Definitely a big list. Russo-China war. Fictional, of course. But also some that go past that. Fictional. Yeah, let's play somewhat here. I don't know if I want to do a specific stream on Volume 1. If you want to get the classic Tales of experience, this might be the game you're looking for. Because this includes basically everything with the newest but classic engine. So let's play our core 44. Let's play as the Germans against the US. September 44, location France, east of Nancy. And unit scale is company batta battalion scale. Eight turns.
Our voices are not using chemicals. Okay. Not using nuclear weapons. Yeah, but I guess um, Nazi Germany at that point of war would have used everything if it would be effective. Chemical weapons, yeah. Well, of questionable use. I mean, the, Chi not the Chinese, the Japanese use it in the Chinese theater. But also suffered some yeah, side effects of that. Good, but it is included, especially for modern warfare scenarios. Yeah, Cold War, where you might decide to go chemical or nuclear. Perhaps also on the Chinese theater. Uh, the Forgotten War. Before World War II started, Japan was active on the Chinese theater and committed there some nasty chemical warfare. Re or, and biological warfare especially, very nasty. Very cruel. Yeah, so okay, and, but we are now here in France and have to push uh, 111th and 113th Panzer Brigades are taken towards North Sea. Okay, 8th Infantry Division US captures Brest. Yeah, and we will use the 3D version. I mean, you can of course play it in a classic 2D version, uh, which looks basically like what you might expect from an operational war game, but this scenario comes with a really low unit amount, something that is really hard to fight nowadays. And I think that is a really good showcase to switch to that 3D vision, which I think was dropped with the newest TOAW, which makes yeah, pop sense. I don't know how many of you would really play with that, but here we clean map, so we can do that. Okay, so we have here the 113th recon. And our objectives laying in front of us, but pretty sure there's enemy units. Let's check what we have else here. Yeah, we need to capture those one, two, three objectives. So let's check out with the recon. Let's drive forward. Yeah, and we get into contact with an unknown unit by the US Army. Yeah, it is depicted by armor armored unit, but doesn't mean it is real armored unit. Okay, yeah, so now we will. Those units are held in local reserve, so they are not active right now. Yeah, engaging. I mean, we could engage that unit with limiting casualties in order to f a probing attack, basically. But that would cost us a one turn. I think the turn time limit on this scenario was very low. So we might rather recon by force and attack. Here we have the Panzer Brigade first. Yeah, bring them in. Let's go really check out what they're offering here. Or do we not do no, I don't think so. That was what I was looking for. Your report, yeah, that is. They are running Panthers.
Okay. But before we commit to that attack, we might probe the flanks. Uh, let's see what is going on here. Do we have another... No, we don't have another reconnaissance unit. We have infantry, which is probably mechanized or motorized. Uh, let's use those guys from the rear first. And move into enemy territory. Okay, having made contact with two units. Unknown, unknown. Okay, so there is, this might be indeed armored units, this is an infantry unit, despite being unknown. Yeah, I could probe the south, because this here, the 111 Panzer Brigade is sitting ducks currently, not being active. Yeah, but if they are in this area of operations. Do I really want to commit myself there? I don't think so. I mean, they might become sooner or later active. Uh, that is infantry. Let's send on out another infantry unit to so gain information on them. We could engage them. We might do that. It is an ATAA brigade, probably 8 8s, which are dual purpose. Yeah, do we want to disperse our tanks or do we want to focus them? Yeah, Schwerpunkt. Even if we defeat that unit, another unit might, might be behind it. Might try to overwhelm whatever infantry is sitting there. They are sitting here in hills, roads. That is something we might can handle. And those 8-8s. Eight yeah. Hmm. Let's definitely go here, combined arms. And supplement those, this panther unit with the infantry. Formation. Then we have something that appears to be a sh Sturmgeschütz. Yeah. They have nine of them. Stucks four. We might bring on those 8-8 eight, eight on the hill. I mean, they are sitting on hills, but let's do that. One infantry unit left. No, but those guys are not active. Yeah. Local reserve. Okay, well, now let's plan an attack. I definitely want to overwhelm that position here. Let's see what we have here available. Three units. I don't think we need to invest. I mean, we don't know even what we are attacking here, but let's go all in. And yeah, I mean, Let's attack those armored vehicles here. This everything we have, yeah, including the 8-8s. That's it. Let's resolve the attacks. Yeah, 
But uh, first formation was withdrawn by the US. However, they because of the mobile tank unit behind, they reinforced that position. Let's check out casualties. Three Shermans were disabled, one Greyhound. Why we lost at least no, we lost a medium scout car, okay. Two support vehicles, four rifle squads. I think that is acceptable. But not impressive. Good, combat in the north. Uh, that is quite a big formation and not everyone retreated there. The US lost three Stuart tanks, one support half track, several support half tracks. While we lost a lot of infant yeah, some infantry. That is also acceptable, but not impressive. Now the US Army takes a turn. What? Jimmy! Counter, counter attack. Yeah, reserve forces try to maintain the perimeter, but are pushed behind. Yeah, a uh, town was captured by the US Army counter attack. Yeah, welcome to 44 German experience. General, we will now commence a counter assault that will break the Western Front. Okay, 10 minutes later, defend, defend, defend. Uh, okay, it seems like. And now we need to watch out all those guys. Uh, they retreated. They are not on our command. But we gained some units of the 111th, which is now active, while those units are retreating and routed even, so they are not active. And this makes things more complicated. Good. One objective is free, it seems. Immediately capture it. Where's my Panthers? Here. We are in contact with an unknown armored unit. But that is on the hills. Let's bring definitely up the 8-8s. A lot of infantry force here. But this hilly terrain, I don't know if that is really worth for infantry. We have another infantry unit activated here by the 11th. 111th Panzer Brigade, which will bring up on those hills. They might have an easier time to defend there. Here we have also hilly terrain. Yeah, ATAA. Let's see what they consist of. AT guns. Okay, AT squads. 8 8s. Machine guns. I think they might do a good job here in the hills. In order to stabilize the front line. While here in the open terrain we might bring in Stucks, which should have a pretty good capability of defending. And we might also outflank them. On the other hand, this will expand the front line. I want to keep the front line short as possible. Yeah, I don't know. Let's check out that unit. Do we want to counterattack? They only operate Sturmgeschütze. Uh, Stucks are not really good in fighting infantry. They have some HE rounds and whatever, but no. Might be an idea to counterattack here, preventing them from isolating 
in a counter offensive a single unit like the Stucks. There's only eight Stucks here. While this unit is identified, let's quickly check out what we have here. Ah, that is two units. They also have armored support. Same here. And they also have tank destroyers and Shermans. Here we have a steward unit. Ah, oh, no, it's an unknown unit, but it is a light tank unit. In the north, they currently look somewhat weak. In the south they look strong, but they bring up further RT might be already able to participate in the battle from the distance. We have one unit left, which is a quite strong unit here, equipped with Panthers, Panzerkampfwagen 5. The question is, where do we want to bring them in? Or if you want to keep them as a reserve. At that, we will definitely engage. Question is, do we want to do a focus attack or a wide front assault? Let's see, what is that infantry unit? Veteran supplied. Okay, there's not some poor Jimmy's here, and we are facing an unknown unit. Hmm, we could bring those, no, nah, those pandas can't reach out for the northern front. It might be a better idea to invest into the south. As in order to keep unit cohesion, because they belong to the 111th, while here the 113th is operating. I don't like to mixing up units, it might just provide some C2 or C3 challenges. Good, we will supplement those guys sitting in urban. Those guys sitting in the open. While facing units which have entrenchment. But are also in the open. We need to hit them hard before they can deploy their air or RT power, which might overwhelm us. Uh, at that state of the war the clock is ticking against the Germans yeah but having a two angle attack armored is pr probably better let's bring those panthers in here and prepare an attack on that position that would also help us to shorten the front line Watch me, that's quite a lot. Wait, 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 Tony, why so many units? I only see three units participating here. Uh, we need to watch out, yeah, you might call in mobile units from the, from the vicinity. I don't want to do that. So we might do rather a uh, group attack with ignoring losses. Taking that position might be important. Same for those guys. Ignore losses, get this US armored unit removed. Here, I mean that objective is currently yeah, it is occupied by two units. The third of the 37 tank. And first of the 51st Infantry. Can we handle that? Probably not. However, those Panthers are also free to participate. 
but I don't want to bring them in into the open terrain. Might rather push that, yeah, but that is the objective. Especially Panthers might lose a lot in urban terrain. Uh, they are rather designed to be like a modern design. Heavy frontal armor, but low flank or rear armor is not a tiger. And also ATAA, they might be not that mobile. I think they are ill-fated for urban warfare. So we might rather contain here for the for the time. Those guys sitting in forest, yeah, I don't want to engage with my pandas into forest. That unit sitting on hills, that might be okay. They are quite entrenched. A reconnaissance unit might completely replace and check out if they can somewhat raid the rear. Good, furthermore we have Stucks, which you might use to reinforce an important position like that one here, especially with those two units engaging. We might need that Stuck on the hills here. But that is us exposed here. Very exposed. But that is not. Yeah, okay. Send them in here. I was thinking also participate here in this attack. Yeah, here we'll proceed with limit losses. I'm happy to, to keep that position while in the north we will push completely in. Group attack, ignore losses. Okay, done. Good, defenders lost a single Sherman, a Hellcat, while we lost more Jimmy, a five Panthers, two Stucks. Yeah, that is absolutely not a good resolution. US took no losses, but well, we took seven losses. Okay. Here we managed to disable seven stewards. We're well, losing a Panzerkampfwagen 4. Free uh, and a lot of infantry. Rather draw. That's a little loss for the US. Jimmy, that is getting out of hand here. 21. Ah, oh, Tony, yeah, we need to watch out here. That was too. Yeah, US is pushing us back, also taking losses, a lot of losses, this time. But managing to push us back.
this rather little losses. Turns remaining six. Okay. Good. Yeah, that was not really a good turn for us. Let's attempt a flank move by the recon unit. Yeah, that unit is facing heavy armored opposition. That objective is currently held by one unit, but hmm. we are not in good state here for offensive operations. Almost every unit is not really ready and capable of offensive operations. Yeah, pushing an armored unit forward here in that tile, I don't know if that is really helpful. Because here they are entrenched, at least to some ex extent. We have a recon here, but that is currently reorganizing and not available for further orders. A Stuck unit could attempt to flank out, but that might of course also provide some dangers. On the other hand, we need to find solutions here. Ah, but Stuck's in the forest, that is probably a worse terrain. We can put those guys in. Good, let's try to break through those lines. Establish our 8-8 eight, eight and Panthers here. Now let's keep those 8-8s eight, in the rear. On the hills there might be a good defense unit. But we also need to prevent that those pandas will get cut off. Let's send in. Ah, Jimmy, those Stuks are routed. And those guys have retreated. Not sure if that was a good move. Let's attack them by minimizing losses. Same as the pandas. Which can't attack. And expand. Uh, Tony is only a single unit, right? Uh, they managed to interrupt us. What 
with the Adi assets. Yeah, most units are in really bad condition. Okay, nice. Uh, we're making some progress here. And the US said nothing. Okay. That is a light tank unit which is in very bad condition. We definitely need to utilize that, exploit that. But I also have here this CCA unit, which is um, in mediocre condition. And that unit is in good condition. Yeah, we Maintain patience. We might raid the rear here. 
But we of course need to maintain a front line that unit is in two units. Armored units, tank destroyers and medium battle tanks, Germans. They might counterattack at any second. Dead 8-8. Eight eight. Yeah, we might see uh, condition is very bad. Those guys are routed. That AT unit might participate, but this infantry Jimmy sitting in objective are absolutely ready to take the brunt. Before we do anything stupid here, we might wait. We might attempt to remove that unit calf with a limited or minimized attack. And could probe those two infantry units in order to keep them busy. Took losses. Jimmy's. That doesn't look good. But here in the north. Okay, okay, that. It's still a slight armored unit, check it out. Rate them. Ignore losses. Cut them all off. And you, Tony's, uh, you routed. Somebody needs to maintain the pyramid, otherwise, we lose our objectives. Infantry unit is ready to go to this open destination. Yeah, ignore losses. Attack that. I think that is this light tank unit that is absolutely devastated. 
And those pandas, yeah, difficult question. Do we want to push on that? Actually, who dares wins? This might just screw us uh, entirely up. But we might have a chance to isolate here extremely. Twenty feet. Pandas. If you can cut off that limit losses, come on, let's attempt. It is reported to be a HQ unit. Those Tonys have absolutely nothing to battle us. While the rest here, this unit is in bad condition, counter attack. Ignore losses, counter attack. No, wait, 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 wait. They are cut off. They are cut off. Let it soak in. Yeah. But attack them. Yeah, keep them busy with minimizing losses. Yeah, this objective here can this be handled by this ATAA unit? I mean, they have a lot of stuff here. They also have machine guns. Yeah. It is not here some pony festival. You can't choose your destiny. Probe them. As a probe those guys, you will be assisted by the 111th first 2011. Is that correct? Yeah, but they had some uh, late water, it's really some crazy uh, designations. The unit is exposed here. Probe them. Good, they didn't take any losses, so I guess we took heavy losses. No, nobody took losses, yeah, probably both units low on cohesion. That is, oh, okay, this unknown unit, let's see. That is those stewards. 
We managed to inflict some loss on us. Actually, three pandas lost for nothing. Oh, yeah. Well, it seems like the US spring in Air, Air Force. But we have them in some at least minor pockets. But we are support now. We, we have some supply lines here. And that is basically Germany 44. Yeah. But they, this, they managed to. Nice action here by the AI. They managed to open that up. But we also managed to stop the counter offensive. Good. What happened here to my uh, missing units, which I don't like? Did they... There's some units missing here, right? Nah, that was a yeah, recon unit, exactly. They pulled back, retreating. This unit, yeah. We might again attempt to cut them off. Would be, of course, better to capture that open center here. I simply don't have the manpower to maintain a proper encirclement. Glory times of Baba Vasa encirclements are over. But here in the south I see opportunities. Yeah? We will definitely engage that heavy arty unit immediately. Ignore losses, blow them up. Don't allow them to open up that corridor. Yeah, that panther unit. Okay, there's two units. I mean, you can maintain a perimeter, but we might as consider to redeploy panthers in order to. Combat that exhausted tank unit. Yeah, that might be an idea. Why pro? Why attacking them? But only probing them. I just want to keep them. Uh, we still don't have that corridor open here. That unit is in good shape. We are in bad shape. Uh, everybody is in bad shape here. But only maneuvering won't net you any success. Uh, we of course also need to conduct combat. Here, uh, let's try it out with minimizing losses. That would, would tremendously shorten the front line. That would be real dream to happen if we could shorten here. Those jimmies are not in the best condition anymore. Here in the north, it is looking for both Grim, but we can. Yeah, they are so retreating, so let's utilize on that. We can re tremendously shorten here the front line. Why we also need to maintain that there is a CCA operating, which can quickly break out and raid our rear. First, capture the objective here. And cut them off. But those infantry units are currently reorganizing, they are not able to maintain somewhat a perimeter. 
with at least one hex, which might enable you to exert control. But still, those guys will be challenged. Then we have this ATAA, that is the 88 unit. Thank you. There's a light tank unit, but those guys are absolutely in bad shape. Yeah, they are not worth to attack. We could shuffle around here. Question is, do we want to do that? I think those pandas are currently busy attacking that unit here, is it correct? Yeah, let's do that. But minimize losses. Those guys are not in the best shape. We might probe them because that is our objective. Those guys already have orders. Those guys have no orders. Assist in taking this because it's what tremendously short in the front line. And here. Yeah, hold. Hold. Those guys might run out of steam because they are now definitely cut off. The US doesn't bring up some reinforcements quite fast. We might manage that. Well, the US not taking a single loss. That doesn't look good. So I guess we took heavy losses. Okay, we lost some mortar and a rifle AT squad, which probably tried to sneak up on the tank and got eliminated. But Julie, those are the units. Come on, tell me that they they lost three half tracks, two rifle squads. Okay, we lost nothing. Okay, at least some good message. News. But they lost here some utility vehicles. We lost support vehicles. Uh, that is not really the best outcome. Oh, Jimmy, I think uh, you was even eliminated here. Yeah, I think we lost the entire unit there. That is. Catastrophic. The uh, US going desperate but still in a pocket, which we might maintain. I uh, managed to link up again. I think they broke up reinforcements. Yep. Inflicting immense casualties on us. Which means we need to pull off that pocket. Yeah? But most units are not in combat shape anymore. Just can shorten the front line again, isolating that armored unit, which is really in bad shape. And hope for the best. Yeah, all of our units are basically. Jimmy, reach the objective, come on, reach! No, <laughs> not able. Everybody is exhausted. But let's provide the US a challenge. Yeah? To free up the... Let's keep the... Ah, uh, only the entry can reach the open, okay. Okay, Panthers drive up to the hills. Nice. 
You Jimmy stay there, you reposition here. Let's give the US our objective to free that tank unit. While we will attempt to capture those goddamn objectives, but there is almost no possibility right now. It is in front of me, empty even, but we can't reach it. Every unit is in severe shape. Just barely managing the front line. Jimmy, come on! It is not that far. Drive up. But those guys took probably heavy losses. Yeah, Jimmy, come on! Ten tanks left. Uh, routed, but they are routed. Yeah, I don't think I attack is a good option here. However, that position is providing us entrenchment. That position, yeah, let's reposition. Armored cars in the forest might be not that effective. However, this move might now endanger the second of the 111th to be isolated. Those infantry gyms push in. Let, let's attack them, probe them in order to prevent that. Because they are also in bad shape. But that attack has, has the only um, reason to prevent a cutoff here. Yeah, they inflict no casualties, but lost a medium MG, okay. Yeah, that, I like that, yeah. If those units are completely exhausted, disorganized, they are simply not fighting well. Nothing is happening, yeah, because those units are in bad shape. But still, rounds will be exchanged. And we are back, but that unit is still routed. I don't know what she can do here. No. Sure, he's streaming. Tony! Sure, we do. We will keep them probing. We need to keep them, those guys busy. Uh, I mean, they can't move free out because they will endanger themselves to be cut off. But I'm more interested in the objective. I don't want them to retreat to the objective as well. Let's keep them busy. Yeah, I said intelligence to stonk. Well, Jimmy. But without cheating. Uh, cheating is a separate option. That simply means that the AI will probably the AI will gain some information that it shouldn't have. 
but of course you want to play with the best AI. So we're not ready to engage that unit. I mean, they are exposed there. They managed to reposition those ponies. But the Austrians can take the objective, but not this one. Watch, oh, 25 points. <laughs> but look at this in the north. That is way more important. Uh, the 25. Uh, it's going out of Let's take the RD unit. Do we go on counter attack? Limit losses, but attack. Ukraine is sitting in the open. If you can make it through here, you might effectively cut them off by maintaining a proper front line. Wait, is that our. Jimmy, there's even tanks here. Wait, wait, wait. Tanks can't retreat, okay. I'm facing CCA tank destroyers, so I keep those tanks here. And Jimmy, 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 Jimmy. Here perhaps. But this was uh, what also enabled those force to participate. Here would be better. And participate in nuking that RT.
Go on, forefront uh, assault on that unit. That's everything we have. Okay, yeah, that was uh, Operation Art of War. Century of Warfare. And yeah, see you in the next episode.